Tyler versus Russ, a three-way tie atop the NFC West. So here's what I want to ask you. In terms of a franchise quarterback, who would you rather have, Russell Wilson or Kyler Murray? Well, I'm going to go with Russell Wilson. I mean, the, the you know, the proof's in the pudding. You know how big I am on resume. The other day we had a conversation about who's the most dangerous at this particular moment in time, and that was Kyler Murray. This is not that same question. You're talking about a franchise quarterback. Who would you rather have? And Russell Wilson is tried and proven. He's been to two Super Bowls. He's won a Super Bowl championship. If Pete Carroll didn't ask him to, to and, 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 Darryl, and Darryl Bevel didn't ask him to throw that damn slant pattern to Tyler Lockett that got intercepted by Malcolm Butler and, instead of giving the ball a beast mode at the half yard line, he'd have two rings instead of one. Instead of one, and the Patriots would have five rings instead of six. It's just that simple to me. When you look at his record right now, this man is 92-44 and one as a starting quarterback in the National Football League for the Seattle Seahawks. On many, many occasions, you know what, he was not that dude. In other words, it was the Legion of Boom and the offense evolved around that and beast mode. And then Russell Wilson came into the fray and just showed you what he could bring to the table, so much so that the franchise was handed to him. The keys to the franchise were handed to him. This year, he's been unleashed. And even though he struggled as of late, I would remind everybody he's still completing 69.8% of his passes. He still has 28 touchdowns to 10 interceptions. I mean, he hasn't been god-awful. The reality of the situation is that the vast majority of this season, he's been a leading MVP candidate until the last two weeks. So I look at what he brings to the table, and I'm of the mindset, yo, Russell Wilson is special. I, I got mad respect and love for Kyler Murray, but you got to do it over the, a period of time. Russell Wilson has done that. We know how elite he is. I'm rolling with him. Oh, every GM in football is like, why isn't Stephen A a GM that I can negotiate against? Let me get this straight, Stephen A. You have two dudes. Russell Wilson's a little better than Kyler Murray right now. In fact, he's more dangerous, too. We were just arguing that. You were telling me Kyler Murray's more dangerous than Russ right now. But even the fact that someone could argue, and many people do, that he's more dangerous than Russell Wilson right now, even the fact that they are very similar, the questions even being asked, is Kyler Murray ahead of Russell Wilson in the MVP race? No, I don't think he is. I think Russ is still a little ahead of him. Not that that's one and two in the MVP race, but in terms of their rank there. Even the fact that we're asking that right now, in Kyler Murray's second year, Kyler, Russell Wilson was not asked to do what Kyler Murray is being asked to do in terms of carrying the load of the team. Like, the hopes and dreams, the, the winning is pinned on him. Not uh, Russell had a better defense, obviously, than Kyler Murray early in his career. But even the fact that they're comparable already, and they are comparable. They're very comparable. Same height, you know, more or less the same size, both really fast, both with good arms. Both can, can pick up first downs with their legs, but often use their legs to extend plays, keep their eyes down the field. By the way, both were good enough at baseball on a college level to be drafted by Major League Baseball. They were both drafted. Kyler Murray, I'll mention, was drafted in the first round by, I think it was Billy Bean and the A's. Like, they know what they're looking at, and they know the analytics and all that stuff. They thought he was a first-round pick. But they both still want to play baseball. Talk to Kyler. There's so many similarities between these two. But one is almost 10 years younger than the other. <laughs> 10 years. He's almost a decade younger. Who do I want for my franchise quarterback between two guys who are the best comps for each other in the league? If you said, what's the best comp for Russell Wilson that you've ever seen? You might say Kyler Murray and vice versa. But Kyler Murray's ahead of Russell Wilson's pace and he's a decade younger, way cheaper. But you want Russell Wilson as your franchise QB? Oh, I wish we you see, were GMs, you see, even. Th 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 this, is, this is one, and, this is, and, and you know what? If we were a GM, I'd hang up on you because that's just an asinine argument for the purposes of a debate show. <laughs> of course, it, because he's one is 23 and one is 31. Max, I'm here thinking, okay, we're looking at their talents over the next few years. Here we go. Basically, what you're saying to me right now, Max, is that, okay, Russell Wilson could continue to do what he's going to do for five years. But because Kyler Murray could do it for 10, because he's obviously almost 10 years younger, that's why you would 15. do it. What the, what the hell you say everything else for? Because I didn't know that's what we were doing. I thought we were looking at their talents and saying, excuse me, looking at who they are. Who would you want? I didn't know I got to look at who's cheaper.
I didn't know that I had to look at all oh my goodness. He's eight years younger. So because if that's the case, why even talk about everything else? He's eight years younger. And oh, by the way, he can ball. Uh, you know what? Eventually he'll catch up to Russ because Russ is going to get old. I could have just stopped there. I'm looking at no, both no, of them no. play. Not, no, no, no. And I'm saying no, no. they could. this is what they can do. Who would you rather have as your franchise quarterback? No. Right now. Are right you now. able to shut off your hearing? Because most people are not. Are, are you able to shut? Did you hear what I told you? I was very clear about it. They are incredibly comparable. They are the same size. They're both fast. They have. They both play big. Like they, they are very similar athletes, and they have a lot of similarities right. as quarterbacks. The difference is Kyler Murray but you brought is up better age at a younger and age contract. than Russell Wilson is. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.